morning guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today's video just for my breakfast can anybody guess who i'm gonna be eating like today stop the video right in the comment section who do you think i'm gonna be eating like so I'm going to be eating like KK Fit, I'm training like them for a day. So for breakfast I've got basically an Americano with a splash of oat milk and I've got 100 grams of oats with 30 grams of peanut butter and two sachets of sweetener or like two teaspoons of sweetener and this has got sweetener in it as well. So we've got a sweetener heavy breakfast. I don't normally like Americanos, I only have my coffee as a latte so let's see what this is like. Actually, okay, you know. Mmm. Wow. There you go. And oat, the oats, um, I already know I like peanut butter. I already know I like oats, so you can't really go wrong. There's just a lot of volume. I think that's one thing I'm going to struggle with today is the amount of food I'm going to have to eat. I think the, from the research that I've done, um, cat who does most of the what I eat in a day videos, eats about 2,300 calories. And at the minute I'm eating about 1,600 to 800. So it's gonna be a little bit of a treat for me to eat this much today. So we'll just see how we get on. We're gonna do an upper session later. But right now, let's get this breakfast finished and I'll see you guys at my pre-workout meal. So we're out on a walk because KK Fit every day go on a walk either in the morning straight after breakfast, before breakfast, just getting their steps in. We're also drinking water because they drink a gallon of water a day. I'm yet to figure out how much that is in litres, but we're just gonna keep going with it. Um breakfast has me very full, like I feel very Blech. so getting these steps in will hopefully help me to burn some of that off and feel a little bit less bloated ready for our pre-workout meal and then a big upper body session later and the weather is gorgeous today which massively helps getting these steps in Woo. just egg whites and the turn the light on so you can see egg whites and a wrap so nice and easy some wraps i think i'm going to do four egg whites i've noticed by watching their videos that really they don't do much, they don't do meals really, it's more like snacks, I guess. It's not like all snacks, so there are some bigger meals, but it's mostly just um, stuff like this. And their wraps were a lot, they had higher protein than these, but per tortilla, five grams of protein isn't bad. We're going to have one with some egg whites and some ketchup. I don't have sugar-free ketchup, otherwise I'd use it, but I don't because I don't compromise on sauces. It's just a bit, I just, no, definitely not. Okay, let's make this.
now time for the gym. We're gonna do an upper body session. I'm just about to get it up on my phone so I can go through, write down all the exercises and everything. Um, and en route, we are going to go and get ourselves um, an energy drink. I don't feel like I need an energy drink, but apparently the KK Fit Twins have a bit of a caffeine addiction. So we're gonna go and get ourselves probably a monster um, and then get to the gym. So I'll see you guys there. take basically on a chipotle rice bowl so we've got lettuce rice sweet corn and then some minced beef and a bit of chipotle sauce over the top and we also have a dog who wants my food don't you the macros on this are 659 calories that is 59 grams of carbs, 24 grams of fat, and 60 grams of protein. So a very protein-rich meal. It looks delicious. I can't wait to try it. day and I was just going to do a bit of like a run through of how I found yesterday the training the eating and everything um in terms of the eating I think that personally I would struggle if I tried to carry on eating like that um only because it's a lot it's a lot of volume of food um and it's not it's not restrictive but there's everything in there you make yourself so if you've got any other commitments during the day other than just eating and training then it might be hard to work around especially for a nine-to-five job having to prep all that food before it's kind of difficult um in terms of how i fared yesterday with my macros and my calories i only hit 1833 calories yesterday in comparison to their diet, they normally have 2,300 a day, so that is significantly less. Um, so I ended up on 173 grams of carbs, 62 grams of fat, and 146 grams of protein. Um, <clears throat> mostly in their diet, they keep their protein very high, carbs high, um, and fats stay relatively low in comparison. Um, but I found that it, everything was easy to eat just by the end of the day I was no longer hungry I didn't want to carry on eating at the end of the day and um, so yeah that's that in terms of the training I've woken up very sore this morning my shoulders and my chest are very sore and um, it was very high volume like there was a lot of a lot of reps a lot of sets 
um, and just a few compound movements that the the order of the exercises didn't seem to really make sense to me to have dips right at the end of the session to me like I, I didn't have enough energy left to do ten, three sets of ten dips I would only did three sets of six because and my, my arms and my shoulders were absolutely fried by the end so I couldn't physically get myself up for those last reps so I don't know whether focusing on three or four compound exercises in your in your training day to day training and doing some accessories after is the way I would set it out instead of doing your compounds intermingled with all of the other stuff but all in all it was a good day I felt good I felt like I got a lot done um, in a day in terms of training and I felt like I definitely ate a lot of food <laughs> um, but I'm quite excited to get back to my normal diet today so if you guys have any suggestions as to what you would want to see next from this channel then please give me some ideas I'm always open to new ideas I'm thinking that um, I'm probably gonna do the 10,000 calorie challenge at some point um, and I might give a couple of other influencers diets a go so give me some ideas and we'll see what i can do next thank you so much for watching and remember to give the video a like and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed thank you bye